Politician cum musician Paul Madzer who is affiliated to the Citizens Coalition for Change CCC, party seeks to stop MDC Alliance leader Douglas Munzara from playing his music at his party gatherings. Most of Madzer's political songs were composed when members of the CCC party were still affiliated to the MDC. After CCC leader Nelson Chamisa formed a new party, Madzer affiliated himself to Chamisa. Madzer's music is very popular at opposition rallies. During the ongoing political party campaigns to drum up support for the 2023 general elections and March 26 by elections, Madzer's music has been played by the MDCs and the CCC parties. Ironically, the CCC party claims to be a new baby, but still uses the old music. Madzer told the Newsday that he does not believe in Munzara and his party, adding that they should respect his music and stop provoking the CCC party through his music. If I had the means to stop Munzara from playing my music, I would simply go and switch off their PA system, Madzer said. I create my music for the people of Zimbabwe who are suffering in their own land because of ZANU-PF rule. One thing that is very clear is that I do not support Munzara, a person who recalled people that were elected. He must respect me and my art. It's a way of robbing supporters, but people are not stupid they know where I belong," he added. Munzara spokesperson Witness Dube could not comment on the matter until the time of publishing. But CCC National Deputy Spokesperson Gift Astalos Saziba said due to the dwindling of property rights in the country, Munzara and ZANU-PF have taken everything including the music. Saziba said Madzer remains a strong member of CCC. They can claim ownership of the music, but Madzer is an organic member of the CCC party led by Nelson Chamisa. For that reason they can use whatever they want, but Madzer has already started creating new music for the CCC party, Saziba said said.